And the prices keep falling, folks. AMD is having a price buster sale um, right across the board on the AM on the AMD Ryzen 9000 uh, CPU range, and uh, that's because the reason why these prices are falling on the AMD 9000 is because it's true and it is happening. The Ryzen 7 9800X 3D is coming. It's been officially announced, and it'll arrive in uh, just a few days here. But first, let's talk about these price cuts. Let's talk about these price busters going on. Um, this is from WCCF Tech. And uh, you can now get a 9900X for $382 and a 9700X for $327. The article says, uh, with the announcement of the Ryzen 7 9800X 3D, AMD's non-X 3D Ryzen 9000 CPUs are now seeing significant price cuts. Yesterday, which was, um, well, not necessarily yesterday, I'm a little late to the show here. Um, the day before yesterday, AMD announced its Zen 5-based Ryzen 7 9800X 3D CPU. The first in the X3D lineup featuring 8 cores and 16 threads and 3D vCache technology. Following the launch and following the uh, uh, announcement, AMD is now offering generous discounts on, the, uh, on their existing 9000 CPUs, which include all four SKUs. So here's what we got here. The discounted prices for these CPUs are, for the 9950X, it dropped to $599. It originally sold for six fifty, six forty nine. The ninety nine hundred X is at four hundred and twelve, three hundred and eighty two dollars in that range. The MSRP was five hundred, you know, four ninety nine. The ninety seven hundred X is now at three twenty seven, when the MSRP was three fifty nine. So there's a fifty dollar price cut right there, or at least thirty dollar price cut somewhere on in there. Not too bad there for the ninety seven hundred X. But right here you get the uh, the 9600x, the six core, 249. It originally sold for 279. So there's decent price cuts going on. And plus, when we get we're, the closer we get to Black Friday, you might be able to, it, it. You can reasonably expect even better deals and bigger price cuts depending on your retailer, Amazon, Newegg, Micro Center. You got to stay abreast of this. If you really want to get the best deal, you got to follow these people and track them like a hawk. Um, there is um, sometimes, oftentimes, Paul from Paul's Hardware will do a price tracking so that uh, you can. It, it'll help you uh, get the best deals. He kind of looks forward and shows you the uh, the the price history. So. Usually he does that around Thanksgiving and the holiday season, so I wouldn't ex I, I I would expect him to do the same. So you know, keep an eye on uh, Paul's hardware there. Right here it says it, it, the article continues that the ninety nine hundred X dropping to just three eighty two is one of the best deals you can have, and I I agree. Considering that, um, right now, considering right now, the seventy eight hundred X three D. And the 9800X3D are price consistent. They're selling for this. They're going to be selling for the pr same price. And yeah, the 9900X comes in at about. Well, let's see. Let, let's do a little live look here. Um, because the 9800X3D isn't going to be around until a couple more uh, days here. Uh, it'll be available, I think, the 7th. or the, It's either the 5th or the 7th. I'll find out momentarily from one of the another, uh, another article I'm going to be quoting. But I want to type in 7800X3D. So Newegg has got it. No, that's the 9700X. Here we go. Let's check uh, Amazon. So you got to think, the 7800X3D from direct from uh, on on Amazon and direct from the AMD store is at 477. Okay. Now this is saying that the 9800X3D 
is going to be around the same price. Keep bear that bear that in mind, okay? Um, but the 9900X dropping to just 382 is a great deal. The processor comes with 12 cores, 24 threads, 80 megabytes of cache, up to 5.7 gigahertz boost clock. And whether you are seeking enthusiast level gaming or high end productivity, uh, the 9900X is a perfect fit. Uh, if you need more cores, consider the 9950X, which is now at a $50 discount compared to its uh, MSRP. Uh, it's incredibly fast in rendering, compilation, compression, decompression, and other such CPU-oriented tasks, and outperforms the Cult Ultra 9 285K in gaming. Uh, this is the 9950X and the 99. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, the 9950X is great for content creation. When you need extra cores, if you're doing a lot of video editing, editings and stuff like that, um, maybe even some streaming, it might help there. Uh, the, the extra cores can make sure that your game and your stream are running great. Uh, the 99, uh, the 9700X is another attractive uh, option. Eight core processor, great multitasking, great productivity, productivity performance. Uh, however, the Ryzen 5 9600X is more appealing at $250. So uh, these deals are pretty good. These price cuts ain't that bad. As when you consider that the uh, the 9800X3D is going to sell for 479 480 Okay, there you go. <laughs> How's that? How's that for her? <laughs> How's that for a comparison? You can spend 477 now, today, and get a 7800X3D, or wait a couple days and spend four more dollars <laughs> for 9800X3D. <laughs> what would you do? You get 104 megas of cash? How much cash you get on this? 96? Yeah, boy, that's a really tough call. Seriously, if you, uh, yeah. If I was if I if I was shopping for a CPU, I would probably not be considering saving four or five dollars on the seven eight hundred X three D. I probably wouldn't. I'd just say I'd drop the four hundred eighty five hundred dollars on the uh, ninety eight hundred X three D and call it a day. And availability is again on November seventh. Um, also. Another thing that's been confirmed, and I dropped this in the comment section in one of my previous videos, is that the uh, 3DV cache design has been flipped. So that is confirmed, and that was interesting. And if you, uh, you can probably find, uh, Gamers Nexus had a video on it uh, explaining this process, and they had done some interviews. They had uh, 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 interviews with some people from uh, AMD talking about it, some of their technicians and designers. But I believe there's other YouTube videos that can go. Uh, there was one YouTube video I saw that really went into the weeds comparing the design behind the 7800X3D versus the 9800X3D. And if, uh, uh, if I can find that uh, video again, I'll look through my YouTube history. Now, if I can find it, I'll uh, pop the link in the description or in my own comments. That way you all can check it out. But it was a very fascinating deep dive really goes in the weeds and explaining it but amd has indeed officially revealed that the 9800 x3d cpu uh is coming and its release date is november 7th at 480 dollars and um if your motherboard already has the agisa 1202a bios installed you're set Drop the processor, and you're good to go. It's a drop-in uh, replacement. If you don't have this BIOS yet, uh, chances are it's available from your motherboard manufacturer, and you can update right now. Um, AMD shows off the die design of the 9800X33, which WCCF Tech reported uh, a, back, a little bit ago, just a few days ago, and they showed a D-lid. That's this is the link that I dropped in my uh, comment section where they delitted the 9800 X3D processor, and uh, the processor brings three types of silicon: one compute, 
one I.O. and one CCD die all integrated to operate together to offer a high-performance gaming pa package, and there was no traces. That's how they knew, and that's how they confirmed that the uh, 3D V-cache design was flipped because you couldn't see the traces of the cache on top of the substrate. It was pretty interesting. Let me see. This is a nice-looking D-lid right here. You don't see the traces of the 3D V-cache at all. That's how you could, that's how we told, that's how it was determined that uh, it was uh, flipped. Now, if you look, that's the 78, that's a 7,000 X3D. And if you compare the difference, there you go. There was, um, there, there was uh, no traces there that you would expect for the 3D V-cache. So now it's been flipped. That means the the CCD is closer to the HS the, the heat sink, so they they can offer higher performance. And it's the re another reason why that the 9800 X3D processor is a 120 watt 120 watt TDP processor. So it really uh, bumps up the voltage here. We've got eight cores, 16 threads, a clock speed of 4.7 gigahertz up to 5.2 and boost. A total of 104 megabytes of cache, 96 megabytes of L3, and the rest is L1 and L2. The CCD brings 32 megs of L3 cache on its own, while another 64 megabyte 3D cache chiplet is added underneath the CCD, bringing the total L3 cache to 96 megabytes. As per AMD's claims, the 9800X3D is up to 26% faster in gaming performance than the one I've got in Edna, the 7800X3D. In a total of 40 games, the comparison results in an approximate 8% performance uplift over the 7800X3D, making the Ryzen 9800X3D the current gaming champ. Yeah, I would, I would say so. Compared to the flagship Core Ultra 9 285K from Intel's Aero-like design or lineup, the... Ryzen 9800X3D is up almost 60% faster in games like Cyberpunk 2077. Other modern, tile, other modern tiles such as Hogwarts Legacy and Counter-Strike 2 see over a 25% higher performance, while games like Warhammer 40,000K, Space Marine 2, Call of Duty Black Ops 6, and Final Fantasy XIV down trail see 40, over 40% 40 performance boost. Across a total of 40 games, the 9800X3D comes out to be around 20% faster than the 285K, making it a solid choice for enthusiast gaming experience. AMD says that it's working with game developers to deliver uh, optimized performance on its X3D chips and has collaborated with Saber Interactive and Activision to achieve the best possible uh, performance in uh, Warhammer 40K and Space Marine 2, Call of Duty, so, uh, yeah, once again, it is going to, it is here, it is coming. The 79, uh, the 9800X3D is scheduled to launch uh, officially November 7th, which is in about, so oh, uh, five days from now. And uh, it'll be priced at 480 but hey, you can still save six bucks on that 7800X3D if you want. <laughs> and I think it's wise to hold off. Anyway, ring the bell, like, and subscribe to Gonzo Media. We'll see you in the next one.